and we are back in the Curious Tidy 3, The Thief of Life. We still have the power source, but now we have a needle, a cane, oiler, silicone, and drawer handle. And we have a hidden object scene. Um, all the differences between left and right hand side. Oh, okay, I guess. Not why I was clicking, but sure. We play the record, but we have it. Broken phonograph. Someone remove the crank. I don't know the exact model, so we'll have to make a mold of it. Magic silicone. What? What? I might have no idea what happened, but great. Aha. Uh -huh. That's much better. Is Mary being targeted by Jack? Oh, of course she is. That poor boy. So brilliant yet so disturbed. I know, I know. Now's not the time to reminisce. Here's the puzzle piece. Please don't let him harm her. You're very moving for being just ahead. Have to move fast, there's not much time. Rotate and swap the tiles so the outside images match the pictures on the four corners of the board. Images on adjacent tiles must also match. Okay. Can you... Oh, you can't rotate. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we can't have that one there, but that one could move. Uh, of course you move everything around you as well. Or that one. That was the same. Mm hmm. Could be that one. Could be that one. Wait. 
god, I did it the wrong way around. Um, that's not gonna work. Can't have that many of the same. Pointing that way. Um. Oh no. No, this one has to be down here because there's no one else that looks like this. Oh shit, I'm sorry. Or, I, oh uh, god, I'm sorry, twice. I, okay, so you had the solution I had, right? If you're interested. And then I didn't rotate anything more, I just moved a couple pieces. I moved like two or three pieces. I just swapped a couple pieces and it solved itself. Or it was solved. I swapped a couple pieces, like four pieces or something, two and two, and it was solved. So, that was basically the solution. Ah, uh, there. If you're interested. Uh, we'll click this. So I'm sorry for swearing. Wow. Well, you again? Well, you may have escaped me before, but even you can't escape a bullet! I mean... Watch me. Okay, that looks horrible- like a horrible life for this poor primate. Please let it out. What the crap? I do not think this is good. Looks sad, has no other chimpan orang orangutan, sorry, to socialize with. Nothing. Not good. Dressed to impress, and he most certainly does. He looks sad! This is not a good. I do not think this is a good life for this animal at all. Poor thing. I hope we can rescue it. them afterwards. This is not good. I can press anything here. Time to improvise. What if I found a little helper? Hello. I'm Mary's assistant, Vincent. She hit her head when she fell. It looks serious. Luckily, I'm qualified to treat her injury, so we don't have to take her to the hospital, where Jack could attack her again. I'm going to stay here with Mary. Can you find me something to bandage her wound? Ugh. Okay, she had a wound before, but she doesn't have one now, so what exactly are you bandaging? Well, we'll act quickly, obviously. I'll search for a bandage. Mary, I'd rather speak than sign. Please fix my helmet. Did Rupert type this? If so, I have even more questions than before. 
Yeah, I have one. How do you know the orangutan is called Rupert? Also, again, please give Rupert a better life than this. One of the details is missing. It's broken. I'll have to remove the door to investigate. Alright, kick it in. Or, you know, do that. Whatever. Yeah, I was just waiting for the sparkles. I was like, really? No sparkles? These bolts are waiting to be unscrewed. Alright. Let's try match three. Even if that looked like a pretty cool scene. Honestly. Match three games playing themselves. Go bandage. Thank you. Oh, Mary needs rest now. I'll keep an eye on her. You can look around. Mary's research on Jack should help you. Seriously, you you just needed to bandage her head. It's like, oh, she's good now. And okay. don't hesitate to ask Rupert for help. He may be an orangutan, but he's smarter than all of us combined. Oh, and you brought the artifact Mary was looking for. You talk fast. And why did you make an emphasis on that the artifact was what Mary was looking for? So what do you mean, he may be an orangutan? As if orangutans aren't smart, what? When you're done, just leave it with Rupert. He knows what to do. Here, take this. And best of luck. Okay. Rupert is that well dressed orangutan, I presume. Well, I mean, you tell me, because you obviously already knew that. This should be interesting. Alright. Talke tua Ruperte. Uh. Uh huh. It's hard to see where you have something to do. Need to see what's inside. 502071. Okay. Well, I mean. Ah. Use the wall silhouettes to place the pictures correctly. Select the picture to move it. Frame slide up when placed correctly. Eh. 
you move uh, in pattern. Oh, okay. Ta-da! Sometimes the puzzles kind of solve themselves and you're just there for the ride. <laughs> okay. Uh, this looks like some sort of projector, but there's something missing. Unspecified, vague thing that we will magically find, because why not? <sighs> nope. Okay. Mm. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. His arm is stuck. Oh, okay. That's no good. There you go. I still feel bad for you for having to live here. <sighs> well, thank you. <laughs> I'll save you when this game is over. Okay, the the sound of the of the door to the laboratory really scared me. Okay. No, but see, this is not where I want to be. Oh, fifty, twenty, seventy. Okay. Wait, wait. No, stop. A strict no handles policy here. This box is holes, however. Hmm. Grace. Lightning. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Oh, 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 inventory. Okay. Move all tokens to empty slots of corresponding shapes. Select the token and select the direction. Token paths may not cross. Ah. I know what we're playing now. Oh yeah, we're playing flow. All right. Elevator really needs to stop doing that. Ah, thank you. It feels wonderful to speak again. As you most likely know, I am Rupert. <laughs> and I am hungry. You see, they constantly forget to feed me in all this madness. Another reason why you should not be living here. I want to help you, but I'm afraid my primal instincts are taking priority. You make it sound like it's something. there's something wrong with being hungry. It's, it's really not. Please, bring me some food. I saw Miss Fincher transporting some in a cable car. Here, this will help you. Thank you. I can't lose his assistance now, so I'll find some food. Door code. Door code. Oh, activate the cable car. Alright. Door code is good. Uh, I guess we'll go through the door. No. Oh. You Darn just it. can't drop it, can you? Nope. Well. At least I can slow you down. Nope. So long, detective. Thanks, Jack. As if it was easy before you interfered. Yeah, honestly, your interference makes, like, no difference. Because these people are just destroying everything. Everyone has already destroyed everything for us in advance anyways. So, like, you stealing two cables makes literally zero difference. Really doesn't. 
or really does, I guess. No difference whatsoever. Okay, that is it for this episode. So, thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see ya.